Huntington County woman and her young children walked away from a rollover crash unharmed, and she says buckling up saved their lives. Wayne 15's Angelica Robinson has more on that story. Angelica? Dirk Jill Abnett says she only took her eyes off the road for just a second when her car swerved off the road and rolled over, leaving her and the kids upside down. They were held in place only by their seat belts and the car seat. A trip to the grocery store. I had looked down. Took a scary turn for Jill Abbott and her three children. I saw a mailbox in a trash can. I had started to swerve off of the road. Before I knew it, I had hit something more solid and that ended up rolling my vehicle to the side. Inside the car, her three-year-old son, two-year-old daughter, and seven-month-old baby boy. You say the quickest prayer you can and just put your faith in God that everything it's going to be okay. Now, a broken slab of concrete, a mailbox knocked off its post, and a dented trash can. The only visible signs of that crash on Old Fort Wayne Road near 750 North. But miraculously, she says, everyone in the car came out unharmed. We just got out and sat in the grass, and I just held him tight. And just praise God, because it did not have to end that way. She says that outcome may have been a lot different. You know, you pray that you never have to rely on a car seat. If it wasn't for their safety restraint. So now, inside Jill's home, a sign. I look at my kids and think of how delicate their skin is. And they don't have a single scratch. A reminder that she and her children live another day to laugh and play. Jill hopes this will be a lesson to everyone to buckle up. In studio, Angelica Robinson, Wayne 15 News.